What do I have to say? Earmuffs to him. Earmuffs. They can say, fuck, shit, bitch, whatever you want. Cock, balls. Okay, I'm just putting a point out to celebrate, Frank. <laughs> I love a shameless late night crowd. I love that. <laughs> that is so beautiful. <laughs> Woo! This is the whole app for the next 10 minutes. Like, happy birthday, you're officially a nuisance. Go hard in the paint, dog. Surprise, what your game, bro? What's going on? Send to Dominic. <laughs> actually a setting on it labeled masturbate. <laughs> that the writers of that movie never been to the Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, I am Leslie Small, a uh, comedian, and I am headlining the world famous Purple Onion tonight in uh, San Francisco, California. Oh, famous people such as Phyllis Diller, uh, Richard Pryor, uh, Leslie Small, oh wait, huh, future. So, what you should be prepared to hear are just highly inappropriate things, um, but hilarious. So, enjoy, check it out. I feel like you guys will appreciate the finer things in life, like I do, like bacon. <laughs> let me let me hear it for some bacon. Oh, oh, right? Shit, anything's better with bacon, right? And I, I don't know about you guys, but uh, I save the bacon sweat, the juice, oh. the grease. <laughs> in a jar on my, on my stove top, right? Because you need it in everything, right? Like, anything that calls for butter, you can easily substitute bacon, all right? Or oil, or anything, really. Water, substitute bacon. I buttered my toast with it the other day, all right? It's fantastic, and I don't care about my cholesterol. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Actually, the other day, I ran out of perfume. No. I didn't want to go to work smelling like weed again. Because I'm a lady, all right? So I just took a little bit of grease, just a little bit, nothing excessive, just behind each ear. It was nice. I'll tell you what, I felt saucy all day. Very saucy. This fat guy licked my neck. But not a sensual way, he was hungry. It was not about sex. It was amazing. And then when I got home, I was like, wow, this shit is better than oil of Olay. Right? This moisturized really well. Which got me thinking. Dudes out there, why aren't you jerking off with bacon grease? Right? It's organic. It's all natural. It's a renewable resource. Alright? And I know there may be some like, well, I'm a vegetarian. Well, motherfucker, this joke ain't for you. Is it? No. It's not. Right? Because I don't know. If your junk smelled like bacon all the time, don't you think you'd get more slurp jobs? Right? Which I think is a more apt name than blowjob. Right? Because like anytime I've approached a cock and just like <laughs> like, I think it's adorable, and it's, it, that feeling is not shared. <laughs> See, that is an acquired taste. No, it's not. It's, it's kind of like beer or coffee. You know, like, it's not for everyone. It's confusing something. Like, like, I don't know, like, the first time I even saw it, I was just like, oh no. <laughs> It's hard to clean up. But I don't know, you know, so it was kind of like... Oh, 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 God. Oh. oh, okay. Just, that's for you. That's for you. Oh, it's all over the place. Oh, Seventeen Magazine never prepared me for this. Internet dating. Right? Because if you're going to try and fuck someone you just met on the internet, what are you going to need? Picture your dick. <laughs> right, guys? Right? You got, like, a picture. I don't know. Do you have a picture? Do you have a portfolio? I'm thinking most, most guys have a headshot. A headshot of their dick. Right? Headshot. <laughs> They do. They do. But here's the thing. Most guys aren't giving it the consideration it deserves. These bitches are pathetic people. I see my share. 
<laughs> it was like framed over dirty laundry. Just like, what's up? <laughs> Doesn't even matter. <laughs> He's gonna beat me either way. <laughs> like, what? Is, that's what your dick's saying to me? That's not what you want your dick saying. You know, just pump the brakes. Think about what you're doing. You know? Think about your background. Velvet's sexy. Right? That's a good look. Think about lighting that shit. There's a goddamn Zales ad. These are your jewels. Right? Light it up proper. You know? I'm like, what are you into? You into some kinky shit? You into some role play? That's cool. Slap a top hat and a monocle on him. <laughs> I will imagine him with an English accent. <laughs> right? Or like maybe you're a goofy fuck. And I dig that, obviously. Obviously. I'm talking about jerking off with bacon grease. I'm okay with things. Put <laughs> the googly eyes on it. <laughs> That's beautiful. But like, what I want to see, I never have. I think it would be amazing to see. It would be like an action shot. <laughs> you know what I mean? If you're up for it, and I hope you are, right? Of like maybe like a picture of your dick, full masked, feeling good, right? Yeah. Holding the door open for like the same moment. Oh! <laughs> Fucking game overies, yo. <laughs> Beautiful. 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 <laughs> I think women have penis envy. Or at least when we're at the beach drinking, we do. Because <laughs> there's nothing crazier than like getting hammered and trying to pop a squat in the sand. Am I right, ladies? Because I don't know if you knew this, but uh, Sand is one of the vagina's natural enemies. <laughs> <laughs> if you fall, you will fall. <laughs> you will never get all that sand out. Ever. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Whatever. But you know what? If you hold out, wait it out, tough it out, that's how pearls are made. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.